Hi guys, welcome to the video. In this video I want to talk about our new QR Builder. Now a lot of people have already claimed this, they already have the full package, the light prone agency. Now if you haven't already claimed it, you can still set up a free account. The free account is limited, but you can still set up a free account to test out the QR Builder, see if it's right for you. Now, I wanted to show you some of the features of the QR Builder and how you can use it in your marketing. Now the QR Builder is so simple to use. Let me show you quickly how to start using this. Now one great way to use a QR Builder is using QR codes but with dynamic links. Now this means when you create the QR code, rather than creating a static QR code that needs to be changed every time, once you create the QR code, you can automatically change the link where the QR code is going to. So with this system, so you come to QR Builder dashboard, come to links, let's create a link. So we'll put in the destination link. We'll just use my VIP members area. Now with the system, you can choose multiple domains to use. So I'm just going to use this qrshare.info. I can also add a custom URL alias as well. So if I wanted to just put VIP on there, I could. Then click Create. Okay, so once that's created, I can set lots and lots of different things up on that link. I can add pixels on there. So if I wanted to track the audience who's using the link, who's clicking, I can start to build an audience from that. I can create temporary URLs. So if that URL is only going to be live for a set amount of time or views, I can set that there as well. I can set the targeting as well. So I can target via country, device type, browser language. I can also rotate an A and B split testing. So what I can do is I can split test a couple of different um, URLs there. I can also put protection on it if I wish. And for the advanced section, I can also tie it to a project. So I'm just going to assign it to the online success model project. I'm going to hit update. Okay, so that's being created. Now to create the dynamic QR code, just come back to the dashboard. Just click create QR. So I'm going to give this a name of a VIP. So I can choose the project I'm going to use the online success model the type I'm just going to use link uh, sorry URL and I'm going to click dynamic QR code and what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the one that I've just set up so I've got another one in there but I'm just going to use the one I've just set up there which is qrshare.info.bip now that's created all I need to do is create I can change the colors of branding options which I'm going to do in a moment but what happens now whenever I whenever anyone scans this QR code it will open this target URL now if I want to change the target URL with a static QR code I can't but with a dynamic QR code I can so if you wanted to change this and go to a different place later on you can do that that's why dy dynamic QR codes are really good for marketing so what we can do then is set the colors so we can change the style from square to round if we wish. We can change the dots in there. We can change the foreground type from just a color to gradient. You can change the foreground and the background color. You can change the transparency as well if you wish. You've also got customized color. You got eyes in a circle color, eyes out a circle color. Then you've got branding, so you could add your own logo on there as well if you wish. So, you know, if you, you want this to be branded to yourself or to your company or your brand, you can add your logo. You can change the logo size. You've got other options as well for the size of the QR code, the margin, and error correction capability. So that means how it gets scanned. So once that's all done, just hit create. Okay. 
So that's all created, ready to go. And that's a now a dynamic QR code. So I can change this anytime. Doesn't matter where it is, on whatever website, wherever it's been downloaded, wherever it's been placed, it can be changed at any time. So you can download it. You can download it in SVG, ping, JPEG, or WebP. You can also print it directly from this um, software as well. If you come across to the dashboard, you'll see the latest one, latest QR code I've just activated here. Many, many different types of QR codes to use. So I'm going to go over in different videos. I just wanted to show you the dynamic one and how easy it was to set up. Now here you can see page views, who's looking at it, what interaction it's getting as well. You can also edit it directly from this link as well. So don't forget, with a QR builder, now if you haven't got this as a bonus, you know, you can sign up for a free account now and you can test it out. It's a free forever account, very limited. If you've got the Light, the Pro, or the agency as a bonus, now you have access to every single thing in the system. Now, this is a great system for using QR codes in your market. And I'm going to go over a few more videos as well about the different QR codes, how you can use them in your marketing efforts as well. So thanks for watching and watch out for the next video.